What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to bypass the 4.85 update message for your PS3. You can do this on CFW but this is mostly for HFW users. Keep in mind if you are going to use this for your CFW this will not hide you from Sony you can still be banned going online. If you're going to use this for your HFW hand, this will not hide you from Sony. You can still be banned. Keep that in mind. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing you wanna do guys is head over to the PSX place over here on your Android phone. This will work with Android phone okay and it's version 2.1 it's also compatible with a very old um, Android OS so I think it's compatible with 4.3 here it is 4. Point, um, 4. 4. 2 jelly bean okay so just keep that in mind so it's for Android phones you can use it on on your phone your tablet um any android device okay so go ahead and download version 2.1 so go all the way down right here this version also comes with an update notification on your cell phone or your android device so when you install this on your android device there's an option that you can enable and it will give you updates notification for the ps3 it also blocks update from your ps3 so that means your ps3 won't get um updated automatically all right so go ahead and download it once you download it on your phone go ahead and install it on your phone and locate it so right here you can see that i have it located i have it installed on my phone so go ahead and click it and open it up top up here you will see an IP address this is the phone um, application IP address okay up here in the right top corner you have these dots for more options you have how to use rules settings and credits if you go to settings the bottom option down here that says um, disable the update notifier um, not recommended make sure that you turn this on okay once that's done you can do other stuff to it but those are not important right now what you can do from here is go ahead and click start you will get a notification right up top up there say that the server is active all right so go over to your ps3 now okay guys so now that i am on the ps3 if I go to sign up, you, you will see that I get that message, right? So let me go ahead and show you guys my system information. There it is, 4.84. All right, so all you have to do is go all the way down to network settings. Once you are right here, press X, press X again, press X. Go to custom, press X, wireless X, manual, press right on the D-pad, right again on the D-pad, right on the D-pad. Keep pressing right until you come across the part that says proxy. Go down to use. Now once you're in this section, go on your cell phone or your Android device and look for that IP address. Now on the PS3 where it says address, go ahead and press X, delete everything. It might be empty for you. So just go ahead and enter the IP address that you see on your phone. So I'm gonna enter the IP address. Okay, so that's the IP address, press start, okay. Now press right on the D-pad, right again, press X. Okay, press circle. 
go all the way over to sign up and press X and there you go very simple very easy guys so if I close this down go all the way up to system update press X press X again it will say that I am on the latest so it's very simple like that all you have to do is keep your device running okay so that's it guys if the video has helped you out give it a like share the video around and also you guys can subscribe for more video to come thank you all for watching i will see you guys in my next video